Do you think kids are you feeling better yet or no? Do you want to go in your bed with your blankies? Hey, Andrea. How you doing this morning? So here's Ezra this morning. No, no, no. All right, guys, so we've been trying to decide if Ezra is sick, too sick to go to school today. He seems a lot better from yesterday. Yesterday he slept most of the day though after he got home. He had to bring him home because he wasn't doing well. But uh, still has probably a little runny nose. What do you think, kids? Are you feeling better yet or no? Do you want some kiwi? No? No kiwi? Yeah, you're still wiping your nose uh, a little bit, huh? How are you doing today, Simon? <laughs> Simon, can you eat your cereal? No. No? How come? I thought you wanted some cereal. Yeah, for that specific cereal. Then you know what happened to me. You're just too interested in playing with your cars right now? Ezra, what are we going to do for your sick day, huh? You and Mommy going to hang out? At least you're staying hydrated, huh? With all your juices and waters and Pedialytes. Yeah. This is cereal. Yeah. Oh. Look at this, I'm in the car. I'm hungry. What about the yellow car? No, no. What about Simon? What about Simon? No. <laughs> Look, it's an airplane. <laughs> Open up! Open up! <laughs> oh, you want toast? gotta go drop off Simon. Even though you're sick, you still just have to go drop him off because daddy's gotta go to work. Come here, honey, we gotta go drop off Simon. Then you can come home and rest and go night night, okay? And try to sleep. Simon? No. Do you want a coat? No. You never want a coat, even when it's cold. How come, huh? I'm bringing his coat. Okay, that's it. Okay. Ready? Hop in your seat. Hop. Hop. Whoa, it's in my bed. Yeah? All right, bye-bye. I love you. All right, we're off. Sick day. One of the hardest things about sick day, other than, you know, it's hard to see your child being sick, but um, it's also hard because you can't, it's not like you can just stay home all day and, and help them all day. You still have other kids <laughs> who aren't sick, who need to go to school. And so then it's like, well, I could try and get a babysitter last minute, but who wants to babysit a sick kid? So Ezra's in the car with us, even though he is sick, too sick to go to school. I still have to take him places, um, and he's kind of along for the ride. So poor Ezra doesn't get to really rest until after um, all the other kids get taken care of. Adam will go to work after taking Benson to his eye doctor appointments, and then I'll be able to come home and be with Ezra. I don't know how people do it, if you have to go to work, like if you have a regular nine to five job. I think that's super hard because I feel with kids, you don't know what to expect. Like the unexpected is gonna happen. You'll wake up one morning, 
be fine and then he'll throw up at school and you have to go pick him up. Things happen and you just have to be flexible and a lot of jobs aren't flexible. So I'm grateful that I can stay at home and work from home and do, I do all the editing on our YouTube videos and um, well, Adam will edit sometimes too and Mark actually will edit as well. But in the comments though, I want to know if what you guys do on sick days. Is, do you have a special routine that you do? Something that you like to do on a sick day to help the day go better? to be in bed and resting but I go walk Simon to class so he gets to come with me. You want to go to school? Yeah. Okay. Okay so we just got home. Pat is in his room. I got some breakfast. I'm gonna see what he's up to. Hey honey. He wants the door closed. <sighs> Today, kind of a sick day. I'm giving you lots of choices of drinks. Yeah. So that we can keep you hydrated. Do you want to go in your bed with your blankies? Will that be more comfortable? Come here, let's go in your bed. Let's go in your bed with your blanket. Ezra really likes these types of blankets because he likes putting his fingers in the middle. Huh, you're like putting your fingers in it. Grandma made that for you, so you can put your fingers in it. That's what you love doing. Oh, you want that one too? Oh, good, okay. Good job. Oh. Can I put a blanket on top of you? Like that? There's a drink for you. There's a drink for you. You don't want it. <laughs> okay. I'm not going to close his bag because I want him to be able to come out when he wants. Um, but I am going to shut the door. And probably drop the light. <laughs> Actually, he's not a big fan of the light. So we turned the light off for him. And uh, yeah. Now I guess I'll try and do some editing um, and check on him periodically throughout the day. Poor kid, no one likes a sick day, but hopefully it won't last long. Here's Ezra's first day of his autism school and here's an autism playlist. Remember, if you have an autistic child, you're in good company. <laughs> 